Welcome to the dream, ladies and gentlemen. I'm your host, Amashi, and we're back for some more Opera Omnia reactions. Terra's BT showcase got uploaded recently, and she's apparently getting a rework. Uh, I'm excited to see what they do with her. They gave Kefka what he needed outside of fixing the Kefka bug itself. Like, Kefka got what he needed for his BT. I'm actually very happy. I think Kefka's BT is one of the best in the game now. And I'm kind of hoping... Like, FF6 been eaten. Like, Kefka's BT is amazing. Locke's BT is amazing. Maybe Terra's BT will get the same treatment. I don't really know what they could give to... My main issue with Terra's BT is a similar problem with Kefka's. Although, she doesn't have it as bad. Is that Terra's duration is not long enough for how many turns she will be taking in a row. Similar to Kefka's old problem. Well, Kafka's other problem with his old BT is that HP damage up alone is not good. <laughs> uh, another problem I have is that Terra's BT Plus is, like, smack dab in between a bunch of other characters that I plan on greening. Like, I plan on greening Locke, I plan on greening Gilgamesh and Kafka. I'd like to green Squall. I'd love to green Cloud. And Zack and Ramza. But they're all right next to each other, so someone has to be the loser, and it's not gonna be Kafka, and it's not gonna be Gilgamesh, and not gonna be Zack. So let's see if Terra is a loser in this gauntlet of BT characters I need to green. Uh, right after this goes live, I'll probably be streaming session two of Quarter or two. So, if you want to check that out, you want to come hang out, maybe talk about Opera Omnia, or talk about Star Wars, go hit up my Twitch. Alright, let's start the reaction. What they give my girl? Oh, she apparently got a rework. What is it? Okay, so I imagine Ultima's gonna get Splash. Is Ultima not even gonna get Splash? Oh my god, its duration is the same. What? <laughs> Jesus Christ! They are- let me see that- I don't normally pause reactions. Uh, let me go back. That's a lot, honey. <laughs> okay, let me look at- let me see if I can understand what- Okay, so... Hmm. Duration's the same. They beat the hell out of a... I can't remember the... Out of Chaos Wave. Okay. Currently, Meltdown's my go-to. Okay, that's really good. Meltdown got some stuff. How's Meteor? Eh. Let me look at Meltdown again. I feel like they kind of dropped the ball with Meteor. No splash on Meteor. That's a little disappointing. Uh, how's Riot Blade? Riot Blade is significantly better. It's basically the same in the same tier as a uh, Havoc Wing, so that's good. Oh my God, is Le Lena getting level ninety? She is. Oh my God, you can't be doing this. It's, is Shadow getting level ninety two? Oh my God. Well, FF five and FF six are. Uh, are eaten. Let me just rewatch the trailer one more time from the beginning. 
and then I'm gonna try and see if I can pull up what her BT changes. So it's weird that they they're not giving splash to Ultima. It seems maybe let me let me. Yeah, the, the Ultima didn't get any splash, which is bizarre. But I'm happy with a rework at least. Outside of Meteor, I think they, much like Kefka's Meteor, they're not giving Meteor the same love as it should be getting. As the rest of their kits. Like, Kefka's Meteor is bad. I don't know what they were thinking. It should have been, like, 5 HP dumps. Maybe more. Let me look at the damage on Lena's uh, EX again. Yep, that's good. That's what I want to see from Lena. And for Shadow... Yeah, I'm happy with that. Alright, I'll be right back with the changes for Terra's BT. Give me one second. Hey, I'm back. Uh, I can't find the translations for what Terra's BT Plus uh, does or her level 90. Uh, and I don't really have time to wait for them to go up because, again, I'm streaming KOTOR 2 in just a moment. They also, another thing I noticed is they didn't show off her Brave Attack, they didn't show off her HP Attack, and they didn't show off Dual Cast. Which makes me think Dual Cast is going to get the Meteor Treatment, Kefka's Meteor Treatment specifically, and be bad still. I don't know why they're touching most of a character's kit, but leaving... It's weird. I don't know why they touch up some stuff and then leave out other outdated stuff alone. Like, Sneering Clown should have been framed, should have been golden framed, instead of just silver framed, if it was gonna have just, uh, 20% down to attack, defense, and speed. Ah, uh, but anyway. Thanks for watching. Come check out my Twitch. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell for notifications. Yada yada. Till next time, gang. Oh, and I'll also be streaming Opera Omnia later tonight as well. And pulling for, uh, pulling for Titus. If you enjoyed the content of this video, please like the video, comment down below, share the video around, and subscribe to the channel, because it tells me you like my content and want me to keep making it. It also helps the channel grow. Until next time, later.